So hello, welcome to the intro to this operation that I'm yet to name because I'm stupid. Filming this about four weeks after we actually did it because I've been busy finishing off college and stuff and not being bothered to make a video. Here at Top Secret Order HQ, otherwise known as my new house in my Star Wars pyjamas. Star Wars is cool. I mean, I've got like a TIE fighter and like a Darth Vader face and a Stormtrooper and like an Empire symbol. It's like a sunwheel. It's pretty cool. Anyway. Yeah, so for this, for emphasis, this was, I know I promised a 6 day operation, but personal circumstances with Fratu H's shit, he had to go back to his house and stuff, and his sister was causing the drama and all that shit. Anyway, he'll get annoyed at me for divulging that personal information, even though I don't know his name, anything, but yeah, whatever. So, yeah. So we just did it like an overnight operation and hiked back. Mostly as a gear test, which is actually quite good because the sixth day operation would have been fucking hell if we hadn't tested our gear. Not really for me, but for Atav H, lacks the experience that I do. And he had really some really shit equipment. <laughs> so thank fuck we tested that stuff out and got him out with more gear. Right, we've decided the standard issue order rucksack, so if you want to join, contact me and I'll get you, I'll send you a kit list and what stuff I'll buy for you and stuff if you want to join the order. It's one of these army surplus um, DPM ones. Anyway, yeah, so let's get started. Oh, I should say um, the fucking phone runs out of charge, so I mean, I'll have a wee bit at the end that explains that. Alright, so we're here now. The order members are like here having lots of trouble at Mogai train station for the super operation. It's going to be six days, but it's only two because of some um, real world commitment that's not related to the order. So, yeah, I'll show you where we are. We're here at the start of the West Highland Way, and we're going to be here. And we're going to start our operation right now. We're going to be walking up to Dremen. And then to some place called like Rowdadden Lodge or some shit. And that's going to take about eight hours. So I'll get back to you more about about halfway to Dremen. Yeah, that's order kit. Right there. Dude, will you get a full body video of me? What? Get a, okay, you're on. Yeah, there you go. That's you. Right. And this is the kit that I'm using. This backpack is used as fuck. We've got all this crown inside. We'll show you guys later. Alright, see you remember. Right, bye. Okay, so order members are here at the Scraggs. We'll be walking this way <laughs> down into this thing in mid jig here with all these stupid things and this weird penis. That's, dude, you can uncover your face. <laughs> Mulgave in Bloom. I know it's pronounced Mulgai. Shut the fuck up, old people. They're there. Let's see. Been there. Been there. Been there. I've uh, not been there. Been there. Been there. That was fucking awesome. That was awesome. That was shite. That was pish. Fuck the devil. Praise Jeebus. So now we're like walking down here. And I just imagine it's this way. So yeah, that's that. So it has all these languages, but there's only. Actually, they're all European languages, so they're all welcome here. Or from, what is this? Is that Polish? Or what the fuck language is that? No, that's like Belgian or some shit. No, why did that be Polish? I'm fucking retarded. Camp site, more like camp shite. <laughs> so we're currently here in this park. It's like rule. Right. That's back the way. That's the ass way. This is the, the dick way. <laughs> So now we're here, and it looks nice. Yeah, cover your face a little bit, dude. Just like, hide it. Yeah, backpack stuff. There's my feet. So we found some water. That rules in. There's like a mountain fucker over there. And there's like some trees. And there's a clearing. Very likely you could hide an anti-tank gun in that cleaving. 
So we're here now. We're about five miles out from Cole Elm. And um, we're like walking. We have some gunfire, it sounded cool. And there's like some smoke, so something making a fire. Which is awesome. Fire, 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 fire. That's cool. So over there, there's a fire. We found a fire. So we're going to go check it out. We'll get a closer, closer look see about the fire. So we found a fire. That's awesome. Look at that. Slug. Slug. Don't step on it. Just leave it, leave it alone. I'm going to poke it with a stick. Poke it. Poke it through though. Right, buddy. Where's it going? Hey, <laughs> you shrunk up. So we're here, and there's like mountains, and foggy mountains, and they're down the hill a bit, and like a field. Did you not on the video? It's fine. Yeah, that's that. We're going that way. This isn't the video, by the way, so I'm not going to show on showing this thing. So yeah, we stopped for a vest break. We'll take out the Epsom stove, cooking some beans or mess tins because we're cool dudes that do that. Dumplings, and there's a bin over there. All the members there. All us there. It's raining. We're under some good canopies, so. Pretty sorted. Bridge and chat. So we're crossing a bridge. This is uh, the crossing. That's down there. So we're two miles out from Germany, we've been walking for about three and a half hours. But we've not really, we've actually been walking for a more like two and a half hours, but we stopped for a couple of breaks to get like a coffee at this little place and like stopped to eat our rations and stuff. So apparently there's fish in this river, according to the sign. That's pretty rad. Anyway, okay, no more updates till we get to Dremen and then we'll give you a, a longer update. So I know we said no more updates, but we met this cow. Her name's Captain Moo, or I think it's a dude actually. Maybe it's a baby cow. Yeah, I think it's a dude because it's only got a, one dick, so... It's only got one dick. Yeah, this is Captain Moo, the cow. And that's just pal. Um, Lieutenant Uddles. Now... Dude, go feed it some scar. Pick up some of this shit and like, feed it to it. It'll eat out your hand, it will. No, pick a big, a big clump, like a huge bit. You get two, you get two big clumps. Okay, now walk over and feed the cow. Look, it's, it's it, Captain Moo, he wants some. See, just put your hand out flat, bro. Uh, it's got a big fucking Just put your hand out flat. Dude, he'll eat off your hand. <laughs> He's got a big fucking tongue leg. Alright, Captain Moo, we'll see you later. So we found a bull just outside Drimmon. Oh, it's, he's angry, man. Look at that bull. It's gonna kick some ass and pump all the bob cows. Hey, it's a horny cow right there. This one's got its arse to us. It's going to be the seductive eyes. No one to cows, it's all the head. So we arrived here in German and uh, got our stuff and all that, so I'm going to swap the camera around. So, there are all the members there. We're going to be going to this place. Almaha. Let's get our kit together and get going. Had a good 10 minute break. Gonna keep on moving. Van and shit. There's somebody with a golf, so they must be a dick. <laughs> so we're walking along this way. We took the fucking wrong way. They went the proper West Highland Way way, which is over there because we were fucking stupid. So this way is just as good. We'll be at our campsite soon. There's this desolate wasteland with like a heavy ice mountain in the background and this pool of black water.
almost to our destination. Two more miles to go to our campsite for the night. Now that we will walk about 15 bloody miles to do. So, we'll be there about five. Half an hour. So now we're going to here in Balbahar, have you see it, we're going to walk to where we're going to pitch our tents. Now night time. Oh dude, are you still outside? Yeah dude, what's up? Please get, do me a favour, can you untie this shit from my tent, because otherwise I can't close it like this. Alright, cool. It's fucking tied and it's tapping this bit. You want to tie it at the side? Yeah, this side's tied up, can you untie it so I can close my tent? No, no, that... Is that side tied as well? Yeah, they're both tied. Okay. Wait, which side's tied? Wait, what are you talking about, talk about tied? Look, look, look at this blue thing, it's tied up. Well, that blue thing? Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, if you can untie that for me, that'd be fucking epic. Oh, yeah, okay. Cool, so we're going to untie this now for the order mission. Okay, disaster averted, order mission complete to, to untie that thing. This is our waste pile, if you need a large dinner. That's a breakfast pile. That's the bag. That's Fatu Beach's tent. Fatu X's tent. It's a Vango 200, or Vango Banshee 200. That's a 12 quid from B&M. Um, this is in my 2L and my mess kit and my saw and my chair. The chairs are epic. So you wouldn't make a video earlier because we fell asleep in our tents because we were so tired from walking like 20 fucking miles. And this is like the forest in like an undisclosed location. No, it's Loch Lomond. Ooh. Ooh. So it's the morning now, about fucking 7.20 I think, 7.25, and I'm awake, have the fire going, ate breakfast already like an hour ago, packed up the tent, took it back into the bag, gotta put all that shit back together, waiting for the other member to awaken, so we can proceed with our mission. The way to dispose of all the garbage and get buried. So, yeah, that's a morning update, and there'll be another part to the video when we like. Actually, no, that doesn't matter. Right, let me talk about how we're going to find a good campsite. Now, we picked this site because it's raining right now. See up in that shitty grey sky. Yeah. Right, the good way to pick a campsite is if you find, if you look at the, the ground, the floor, right, it's really stupid. The forest floor, right? Especially if you're in a grassy woodland like this. This is a woodland, not a forest. By the way, there's a way to tell, and this is a woodland. I'll explain the way to tell, like, right now. So basically, there's trees are too far spaced apart, and less than 50% of the ground is covered by trees. That's how you know. Anyway, so if you look at this stuff here, You'll see this is kind of dry and not really wet, even though it's been raining. So, you know, you've got good cover from all the trees and shit. It's a good place to put your tents because then they won't get absolutely soaked. So, yeah, that's that. So, I'll see you all in a bit. So, all the stuff's now getting packed away. Breakfast is about to get eaten. It's breakfast, what? Well, that's. Fat of H's breakfast, I've had mine already. We're just gonna be leaving once it's packed up. Leave no trace. And there's a fire all gone. No water. And, and, shit. and there's also a drone that, yeah, drone like fly over. Yeah. We're paranoid now. Just fuck drones. I just found a frog. I'll call you Admiral Hipper. You trying to get up there, Mr. Frog? And there's a fat ass slug, but who cares about that? It's Admiral. Closer. Closer. Admiral Hipper. <laughs> what a fat bastard. No. We'll let him chill on his wee, his wee hoose. Right, bon voyage, Hipper. So I hope you enjoyed that fun operation. We enjoyed, you know, doing it and stuff. Also, I've got new shades. Yeah, they're pretty rad. And I lost some more weight as well. 73 kilograms. Fucking awesome. <laughs> right, I'm not gonna get any smaller than that. That's pretty decent. Almost got the six pack, got like a four pack on it. 
Anyway, yeah, because of some equipment malfunctions, mostly involving that fucking shitty solar power bank, I bought a new one. So instead, I'll, that'll be in a future video. I'll show it. I'm hoping to do a solo operation tomorrow because Fatou H is unavailable as he's away on holiday to Portugal. And actually, I'll be making some operations from the Far East because I'm going to Malaysia in like a few days. Anyway, so upcoming, coming up, Far East operations. Yeah, the boats, 100 gun mercs, all that shit. It's all going to be, it's all going to be good. Anyway, so I ran out of charge and our phones fucking ran out of charge because we forgot to charge them because we don't really give a shit about technology. This is out of focus. There we go. Right. Let's scratch them up. And this is, this big tight because it makes me look fat. Anyway, yeah, so uh, that's what happened with that. And it was quite annoying. So I hope you still enjoyed the operation though. We walked about 70 miles. <laughs> it was quite fucked. It was good though. Good operation. Well, fat of H's feet got covered in blisters and I got a fat one. It was heavy fun to bust it. Anyway, so until next time, hope you enjoyed the order video. This is the launch of day two. We're heading back now because it's only a two day op because of um, like real life commitments. I've got the exam tomorrow and this cunt has got his own issues going on, so. Like beating my meat, that's real, yeah. Yeah, and the junkie coming to try and murder you. So. Dude, nobody knows who the fuck you are. Mate, everyone knows. Dude, nobody knows who you are. Hmm. Make that video private though. That'd be, that'd be cool. Oh yeah, well. I'd... <laughs> that one there. The babies, so cute.